Hey, what's up, guys? Brandon here. Um, we're at a shop I haven't been to before in Korea here. It's called Modern Motors. And um, we just put the supercharger on the Jeep. And this is another supercharged Jeep that was here. It's supposed to go out to our Wrangler Mania event this weekend. And it's supposed to um, I'll be sitting out there with mine. Mine's sitting in the back there. So I want to take a look at this thing because there's a lot going on with it. It's pretty cool. Um, and uh, where do I start? I don't see a lot of Jeeps that I actually like the designs too, like everything kind of rolls together, but this one's pretty neat. So, um, I don't know how, what I'm going to start with, but here we go. Uh, first off, he's got a stock bumper, right? Look at the hooks. I don't want to try to get his plate in there. Look at the hooks there. Stock bumper, rigid lights, and he's got a little Batman symbol that comes up here. Now, if you watch my other videos, you'll know that Thunder Customs makes this design, which he has right here. Um, you watch the other videos we have. Now, these are also custom. I think he did right here. They are just pretty cool. I, I haven't seen it like that. I mean, functional. Eh, yeah, they're aluminum. I think they're going to beat up. But he's got a camera up front here. Um, he's got this like invader grill. Um, now they told me this guy really didn't buy anything Chinese because he's totally against that. So everything on here was the original design. So he paid a lot of more more money for it. So uh, just kind of keep that in mind when you're thinking some of the stuff in Chinese. But uh, I don't know that for sure. I'm just. From, the, from one of the friends that I talked to here. Uh, the front mount intercooler for the Sprintex is right here. It's looking pretty cool down there. Uh, he got some RCVs in there. Um, it doesn't look like he has anything for... Maybe he's probably got different axles on here. Yep, he's got Terraflex axles on here. Very cool. Terraflex axles on there. It looks like they're... Actually, that looks like a... That's a Terraflex tie rod, too. Um, steering stabilizer he has on here. There's an Icon stabilizer. Uh, worn winch here Let's see what else he's got uh, but this is a stock bumper that's pretty cool design for that looks like he got po uh, poison spider crusher flares um icon inner fenders um he's got the icon uh kit for um uh, uh speed bumps and the coilover kit thank you thank you whoever told me, told me that coilover kit uh carbon fiber hood looks like the AUV style these are pretty cool i haven't seen these before i don't know what they are maybe somebody can chime in um, these guys right here like gills. I kind of like it. I kind of dig in that. I, I kind of want it. Very neat. He's got a rigid 50 inch up there. Rock slide engineering uh, 50 inch mounts. Um, he has a camera surrounding system. So it's like a 3D, or not 3D, a three section. Uh, he's got the front camera. He's got this camera on this mirror and another camera on that mirror. And he's got a camera in the rear. Plus it looks like he has a camera that points forward here, which is kind of cool. You see right chair. See that? Um, I think he had a camera. He has a camera in the back, right here. This is a very well put together Jeep. Another rigid back there, cube. Running fuel wheels. Um, Acro, Acroprovic. I can never say it. Exhaust, looking pretty cool. That also looks like a stock. Well, no, modified bumper there. It's got a rear winch on it. That's pretty cool. Vantage worn winch. It looks like. Um, crusher flares there. Poison Spider inner, inner rears. Got some Icon arms for the rear. He's got Curry lowers. Curry lowers. Rockside Engineering power steps. Heard this was a new design. Haven't seen it. Um, so let's keep going around the side here. Sprintex badge. Vroom, vroom. Okay. Shocks. Oh, those are reservoirs for the shocks. Okay. He's got the snorkel. The AEV snorkel. In the Evo doors. Now let's take a look because it's also pretty cool in here, all right? Heated seats. These actually have the security box or the security box in the driver over there is pretty cool. And the reclining options for the rear made by Thunder Customs here in South Korea, which are pretty sweet. Um, I don't know what control unit that is, but that's in one up there. It looks like it's got a voltage gauge in or something of that nature. Um, here's one of the pad kits. I don't know who makes these, a few people do, um, but that looks freaking clean. It's gorgeous. So I've got a Padding right here goes over this glove box option here for Jeep. Looks pretty cool. I don't know why he's got. Maybe this is air cool, and that's like a heated seat or something. I'm not sure what he's got there. It looks pretty neat though. Um, this is the inside of those Evo doors. It's kind of hollow. Very light doors. Shut there. 
This is a clean Jeep. Uh, it's got a spiderweb shade, um, shade top with a Punisher logo on top of it, looks like. Uh, I don't know what seats these are. I would love to know, actually, because they're very nice. Kind of just a D-ring mount in the existing hole. It's a great idea. Just to mount stuff randomly there. Great, great idea. Looks like he's got some JW speaker rear tail lights. I don't know what I don't know what bumper that is. It looks kind of custom. Again, he's got these alloy or his aluminum uh, aluminum bumps back here. I don't know what the heck those are. That is that is plastic for some reason. I don't know why. This I don't know what top this is. I almost want to say it's a power top. But just a very very cool Jeep. Cool mats. Oh, this is a seat that Thunder Custom makes right here. I can do a whole video just on these alone. Security boxes underneath them. They're just very cool. There's just logo there, Thunder. Thunder design. I'm gonna talk to Thunder and see if he makes these fronts too, because these are pretty sweet. Anyway, CB down there. There's just a lot going on with this Jeep uh, handles. I don't know who makes these. A bunch of people out there make these style. Quadratech mirrors. Just a very, very cool Jeep. He's on the fuel wheels. I don't know what the, which wheels those are. Um, he's on 37, 13 and a half by 20s. This is a really clean Jeep. Anyway, don't know the owner. We may meet him this weekend and I'll do another video and add it in there. And uh, you guys can see the uh, owner of the face of the owner. It's pretty, pretty neat, uh, pretty neat design. Anyways, thanks for everybody. Uh, hit that subscribe button down there somewhere. I don't know where it's, it's located in that area. It's red. Hit that little bell so you follow me. And uh, comment, rate, subscribe, thumbs up, thumbs down. I don't really care. Just give me something. See you guys later. You get clean to this.